Kia ora, Farnell. Friends, um, just going to let you into a, a little sn snippet of my life. Um, I, well, actually, probably not a lot of you know that I actually am a carer. I care for my wife, and she had a stroke, massive brain bleed, um, six years ago. And as a result of that, I ended up, or well, the last three years, I've been full-time caring for her and uh, she's made really good recovery in that but um, yeah so as part of what I actually do and part of it I try and give back to the community when I can and today I'm out at the Richmond Men's Shed where I help out looking after the IHC lads for a, a few hours in the morning and they're um, really great fun, actually. It's sort of, they make you appreciate the little things. So, yeah, I'm gonna head on inside. So I'll switch the camera around and they're not all here yet. And we'll see how this video goes. I'm a bit nervous about it. So let's see how it goes. All right, this is the entrance to the men's shed. And we're just gonna wander in and see how the lads are and here's honey he's the main ringleader hey. what do you mean yeah. the main ringleader he, he's the man behind the, the troublemaker yeah he's the brains behind the operation so we're going to go in there uh, there's glenn yeah yeah and there's the rest of them a lot more to come yet so so, and over here, more of the team, and I'm going to make myself a cup of tea now and wait for the rest to come in. Righty, we have a bit of a, um, a news thing. First up, I'm a bit slow on getting this video, so, so I'll just talk about this. The Bledisloe Cup um, was donated by Lord Bledisloe way back in 1931. He was a Governor General at the time and he decided that he would donate this big cup to be played between Australia and New Zealand. And uh, New Zealand have won it 54 times and 22 times uh, in succession. So from this year back, uh, Australia, uh, New Zealand have won it 23 times. So, um, it should be the New Zealand Cup. Can't a share broker. This is the All Blacks and that's the new coach. Yep, that's the All Blacks and the new coach. What's his name? I don't know what his name is. What is it? It'll be on the... Who knows what the All Black coach name is? Where? Scott Robertson. Scott oh, Robertson. Robertson. Yeah. 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 Do you know his nickname? What is his nickname? I don't know. They're probably calling Scotty. I wouldn't know. Razor. 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 Well done. Yeah. Razor. Hey? Okay. So yeah. what was the other big match that happened on the weekend? The Marcos won. Yeah, the Marcos yeah. won. So what was this their score? Two five, two seven. Twenty five to Waikato and twenty seven. One of the Marcos. Right, we'll wrap up the news there. Um, the boys have been down to Christchurch as well for the Olymp Special Olympics and they've got medals. But you get the gist of the news and next is roll call. Now we're just having a bit of roll call. Go there, baby. There's not here. No, cross. Cross. Get your roll. Benny Wiley. Like an old dad. Yeah. Sure, Terry. You come up. Oh, you're oh. Uh, so I guess your first. 
Unfortunately, it's end of term, so we sort of. I'll show you the next project. We'll go into the workshop, and the guys are just going to be preparing some materials for Honey because he makes the toys that I think are going to be handed out at the Santa Parade. And um, yeah, so we'll head on in and have a look at next term's project. And there's Stephen. Hi. He, he wants to get in on the action. Right. <laughs> Little buggers close the door on me. <laughs> right, here we go. Right, in the workshop. Um, everyone's standing up. What at the moment? Oh, the, the cleaning up the desk. So there's Murray. And here's the project we have done this term. It's a planter. The guys have painted them. And we'll... See, it's quite a, it's quite a bit in it for them. Screwing, marking out, sanding, prepping, and they'll take that home and they'll put um whatever they put in it. Maybe even use it as a manger for a baby. Yeah, that's Murray. He's happy. Right. Right. Here we've got Glenn, he's planting a bit of timber. It's actually quite good, these guys get to use hand tools. We're going to clamp this down so we can sand it. Just in case you didn't actually understand that, he was actually saying the toilet's available because we've had the, a bit of a problem with the toilet here and now it's cleared and ready to go. So, yep, as you could tell, a bit of humour in it. Well, the boys have cleaned up and are heading out and I'm just going to whiz round to the next terms project, which is here. So, that's a bird feeder. And this is what, these are the prototypes. We sort of haven't quite confirmed the, officially the design for next term. But this is what the guys are going to be doing. So, the old wine bottle and the top, and going to use a margarine container in the bottom. Oh, that's it for me. Stay tuned, maybe there will be another one next time.